I was given a very fortunate opportunity to have a great deal of prep for this movie, so I cleared my schedule for almost eight or nine months and just worked primarily on getting ready for the role. Six days a week he was in the gym, always up at four in the morning doing his weights. He had a trainer. He stuck to it religiously, and it always made me laugh because on Sundays he was allowed to go and drink and eat as much as he wanted. <laughs> he had the one day off during the week where he could do that. Action! A lot of gymnastics, which is something I don't necessarily recommend for anyone over six feet, ah! fell on my face a whole lot of times before I started to land some of those particularly crazy moves. Three, two, one, action! Ah! A ton of flexibility and weightlifting and all that usual garbage that most actors like to romanticize in interviews such as this one. <laughs> this movie has a lot of visual effects and a lot of CGI, but it's much of the action. We really want it done action! for real on camera by Ryan, and he was amazing that way. Action! When they ask me to, you know, be suspended and fly in and kick the bad guy all in one shot. I'm the guy that's gonna say yes, I can do that. I need to begin the kick a little early, maybe yeah. a second early. Yeah. yeah. Sit. Sit. Right. Go. Roll, please. My job is to show up on set, look Martin Campbell in the eye, and never ever tell him no. Right, here we go, and three, two, one, action! The first time he's gonna take off for the planet Oa, and the green energy is bringing him up to the planet to be inducted as a Green Lantern. I remember that exact night. When we did it on the night, it was going up to 90 foot, and we was probably doing 40 foot a second, which is it's pretty fast. We rehearsed the move with the stunt guy. Three, two, one, go! Then we put Ryan in the cables and basically said, well, look, we're not going to sort of give you a rehearsal. We just want to get your natural reaction. Well, you know, flying someone 95 foot up in the air is not your everyday experience, you know. Especially for an actor to be fired up in the air that high and that fast. Clear. You're ready to go. Here we go. Press the button, got the natural reaction. Stand by, here we go. Three, two, one, go! The bottom of his stomach dropped out. I mean, he yelled at the top of his lungs, and it wasn't premeditated. That's just what happened. It's always that thing that when you look up at 95 foot, it's not too bad, but when you're up looking down, it looks a long way. Oh, sorry, was it fun? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, you know, it's a mixture of fun and, uh, fun and explosive diarrhea. Yes. Go! The most odd non sequiturs would fly out of my mouth as soon as we reached the apex. Some random 80s television sitcom reference. Like, I'd get up to the top and just scream, Alan Thick. Everyone wants to play the hero, that's a lot of fun. But also get to be funny and have a lightness to the character and really have that ability to play. I think I found my dream role with Hal Jordan.